right, so I'm sure some of you wanted to know what a CCV crankcase uh, valve um, look like and where the point of failure is for it. Uh, I'm going to show you one that's open already so you can see what the problem is. So as you can see this is the connector. Um, this is um, one of the ports. There's one in the bottom and there's one on the side. I believe this goes like, like this in the car. Um, I already removed a cover here that's like a spongy material. Same as on the top there was a spongy material. Sorry for my glove, I've been working all morning. Um, and this thing goes on top. Uh, nothing goes connected to this nipple. It's just there. But uh, obviously it's meant for something because this, the, you can push down on this. So this is like a little, um, uh, like a rubber, um, I don't know what to call it, but like a diaphragm maybe, if I could put it a name, put a name to it. This thing just goes on top like that. And this is where the point of failure is. All here was broken. So instead of creating pressure, it was just flapping around like that. And so I think what was happening is that the oil, um, my, my car was smoking a lot when you first turned it on. and. What I realized from reading a few threads online is that this thing goes bad and when this thing goes bad it tends to smoke when you first turn it on because I think the oil is supposed to recirculate or the exhaust from the oil or something like that is supposed to recirculate back in uh, but if this diaphragm is busted then it doesn't and so as a result you get a lot of smoke for about I say about three seconds it smokes a lot then it stops I don't know why that is but that's that's what happens and so it took me about uh, I would say a good four hours probably to remove this damn thing from the car uh, and, and I wanted to know that this was in fact what was wrong and sure enough this thing proves it so I had to cut this off um, with this with this blade here and, uh, and sure enough I mean once I took it off I, I knew immediately that this this shouldn't be like this and when I took this off I realized that yep Sure enough, that's that's the point of failure. I had to break it to remove it. It is a pain to get this thing out. It is crazy insane. Uh, this this connection is just for a little heater. It's probably just a, I don't know what the impedance is. I'll measure it later in case some of you wanted to know. Uh, and all it really is is just the wire that heats it up. And from what I read online, it's supposed to, in case you're in a very cold um, place, it's supposed to heat up the condensation I guess there might be some condensation here uh, sometimes and so that this is the point of failure for the CCV uh, crankcase ventilation uh, on a E90 330i 2006 um, I'll post some more pictures on my vlog so you can see it um, if you want to see some more pictures uh, yeah just keep reading down below